Hey everybody, this is not a spring chick. Oh, wait a minute, I know, I'm, I'm excited because Christmas is our live stream Christmas special. It is coming up, which is what I bring out the Christmas skirt for. But, of course, we still do have news. The big news is, is President Obama, of course, came into Southern California last night, was on the Jay Leno show. And, oh, did they hear? Well, not to get political, but, you know, sometimes when somebody tells you, well, when, when the President announces that they think it's time that you should spend more time with your family. <laughs> it's an election year. You can guess what that means. Anyway, for now, we're going to bring old Cam on with comments on the headlines of today. He's <laughs> over yeah. And it's all over for the Republicans. Okay, it's just like, like I've talked before, before we discovered the camera wasn't on, that the neat thing about being in the news business is, is people are stupid. They tell you things like this is the, you know, we're prepared for the headlines that are going to come out. Obama, I said people choose Obama's way over, you know, over the lying Mitt Romney's way. People choose to go steady and true with a man that has brought back the economy over the untested methods of, of Romney. And they basically they're all landslides too. Uh, just like the other night they did their things and said it was a landslide, uh, you know, for Obama on the debate and it turns out that basically it was a dead tie. Well, you know, we hear many times when they do the headlines ahead of time, but don't usually, I know like when, with major games, they do the headlines no matter which team wins. Oh, do they? Yeah. What's the headline if Romney wins? The, there is no headline if Romney wins. Romney does not win. They just made this morning, let's put it this way, they're going to announce the winners now. They're going to basically announce the winner based upon uh, the early voting that won't be tabulated until until a week after the election because of election laws based on polls from the people that took early voting, which basically, you know, actually Mike me the flea said that uh, they're basically telling everybody, vote early and vote vote often because they uh, they said three out of every four early voters are voting for Obama and therefore if you do nothing but use that you come on. Okay, before that, you can come on like if, uh, when the news on the East Coast and say early polling shows it's a landslide for the President of the United States across the United States and then just kill in a wave all the voting from the East Coast all the way to the West and hand the election to... Uh, but they, you can understand that the Romney people are not happy about that, period. And they will win that. This is an opportunity. Where you could see a president of the United States, anybody remember Richard Nixon mm -hmm. and the problems that he had and then after he got elected they impeached him? The Democrats do not like Barack Obama. They flat out do not like him because he's basically got to cost them, they cost him the House, he's got to cost them more Senate seats and he's, he, he's spent money on a campaign of, 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 of search and destroy and burn and burn everything and the Democrats are being they're losing the women folks and a blind Chinese activist says a nephew could face an unfair trial yeah like you're gonna get a fair trial in China I mean that's a how, okay it, it said this is flea folks flea really would laughs about the fact that there is you can get oh flea, yeah that you could get a fair trial in China mm. and Clinton says the US must embrace Arab spring despite dangers you, can, you don't embrace, okay, here's the problem now. The, the rebels in Syria have now, are now being infiltrated by Al-Qaeda people and the Muslim Brotherhood, and basically you trade one set of dictators for another set. They basically don't want to join the modern world in Syria. They want to get rid of the dictators and military rulership, so what happens is the people that Obama supports are going to come in and take over Syria like they're doing all the other countries and they are the radicals folks. And White House told a militant claim in real time during the attack via email. Oh, they got, what? They got filmed. They absolutely have videotape of the guys being butchered. And they knew what? about it was happening. They were watching it from the instant it had started. They knew they've done nothing but lie but don't worry the Democrats have called for a me a called for hearings on just what the White House knew when they knew it, but it won't take place until exactly one week after the election. But here's one person said, he said, you have to understand, if he cost them more, they're going to crucify the President of the United States during that hearing, and he will be bounced out of office in February. Just as soon as he takes office, they'll have, they will impeach him and put Biden in, who is one of them. And protests as Ireland's first abortion clinic opens. 
Yeah, well, I mean, that's basically, you know, that's progressive in a Catholic country. Uh, okay, to, to force an abortion clinic in a Catholic country, that's basically not the way things work was. We, you will see that that clinic will soon go bye-bye. Hybrid vehicle battery creator of Shinsky dies. Oh yeah, he's a, he, he was he was the Rush he was the Russians German prisoner from World War II. We we had our German scientists, they had their German scientists. You know, it's just uh, they were able to click. Okay, our German scientists got out of Berlin before the Russians came in, so basically, their German scientists aren't as good as our German scientists. And U.S. military court rules Fort Hood shooting suspect must shave. Yeah, because, must shave. Yeah, because okay, here's the problem: is Obama is claiming that it was a workplace incident. The guy wants to come dressed in Muslim outfit, which basically sort of belies. Here's also the problem. By the President of the United States refusing to admit it was a terrorist act, the people that were hurt do not get the uh, do, do not get Purple Hearts. They don't get the special medical care, and they don't get re, uh, they don't get uh, remunerated for what being their injuries. All what? because this president does not believe in terrorism. Everybody knows it was a terrorist act. I mean, uh, they're going to set. What's going to happen is that they said. One person after another is going to testify that it was a terrorist act and the president's going to look like an a-hole. Because I, I heard one of the guys said last night, he said, the, the president of the United States is denying the military the rights to vote in this election and the military is going to testify that Barack, he said, Barack Hussein Obama is refused to, te refused to let this be a terrorist trial. And it, it, while the person is still going to take the stand and condemn the United States as a terrorist. So they're going to hand him his head, folks. And speculation swirl about missing North Korean First Lady. Well, they think she's pregnant. <laughs> so, you know. Well, because she basically she was a rock star or something, and they, uh, she's known for looking glamorous, and, you know, and then um, it's hard to look glamorous if you're expecting, no matter, in the United States, well, they, they have a baby bump. Well, and if she's used to looking glamorous, if she's yeah, pregnant, she may not just want to be not, They don't really have, uh, you basically got to, you have to go out of North Korea to find maternity wear. Oh, you do? They don't, they don't have that kind of stuff in North Korea. Basically, they have no shopping. Okay, they, okay, most of the people that are, that are high up in the system in Korea go to Europe to buy stuff. And airstrikes in northern Syria kill at least 43. Yeah, because the military control, okay. It works this way. As long as you control the gates to Damascus, you control Syria, folks. And and basically, they can't get weapons in. They can't get support in. They can't get food in. They can't get medical care in. And so, you know, uh, it's why NATO and nobody is helping the Syrian rebels is because they know that they can't win the battle. It's nothing can be done. Candy Crowley self-destructs. Oh, that's the female that basically, it, they, yeah. that was the one that did the, uh, the debate before this one. They said that she basically has admitted she inadvertently assisted the President of the United States when she should have been being fair. She said she's unfair to Mitt Romney and her personal, she said her personal prejudice towards Romney and support of the President, I mean, she should never, she said, I she should never, never have been... been the thing they said, they, oh, this is what they really hate. They said the Republicans were right. I should never have hosted the event because I was a, a, a news person does not let their prejudice come through, and she did. Oh! But she admits it after the fact. Yeah. So now it's like. <laughs> well, they, that's why. Okay, they threw the second debate totally out because of her, because they said that she interrupted Mitt Romney 29 times. But every time the President of the United States got into a problem, she stopped the debate. And that was not what it was supposed to, that was not her job. Well, part of it is that she also looks really bad. Yeah. Yeah. But it, it, it is, okay, here's the problem, folks. All of these people that worship the ground that Obama works on all get their rear ends kicked out if Romney is the President, because they can't have him, because they, uh, they're, they're losing. Every one of the major news networks is losing its viewers because they're, they don't like the way the campaign is done and they don't like the people that are currently doing stuff. 
And a skeleton of a French man found in bed after 15 years. I, I don't know. I, I would think somebody would notice a person yeah, being. For, of, I mean, uh, like, you do. First of all, there's the god awful smell of thing of anybody dying that you can't hide, which means everybody in the neighborhood had to know someone was dead. And a Monty bubbleism for the Mark Twain of the animal kingdom. Uh, okay. Uh, just because the product says it's got a lifespan of X amount of time. The moon is made out of plastic, isn't worth the paper it's written on, as we know.